Hello friend, welcome back. In a previous video, I already installed our one of the package as an image intervention. Right now, I just want to add another package. Like if you want to add some of the content from your backend. So if, so if you want to highlight it, your text, if you want to change your color, the text. Okay. And also if you want to add the video and the images. So then it should be very much important to add one of the editor. Okay. So, so for the designs in this video, I will install one of the CK editor and also Laravel file manager. So step by step i will show you for doing this first of all you have to do you have to go to the google and for now that is i remove it and now in our google here i just write down as a laravel and then file manager okay so here i just submit as a laravel file manager and here there are some of the resources okay like first of all i just go to these positions that is a github one of the link so i just open it and now that is actually the page and here if you go to these positions like there is actually the documentation there is the installation so right now if you click on on the documentation here you can see that is all that i uh, state that how the things exactly work so you can uh, find out that type of things so that is actually the laravel file manager one of the screenshot okay so i want to also add this type of things in our project so it should be very much interactive you can upload your images from here you can thumbalize it you can list it you can create one of the folder from here okay so it's really very much interactive one of the package so right now i want to install it so for doing this like here there is an option for the installation so like i click on here and into the installation here you find out the installation of the package like first of all there is an installation and installation package so that is actually the things we have to copy so here i just copied and in our cmd like here so that is our root directory as a news so right now i just paste that thing some particular disposition and now click on the enter so it will also take little time for downloading all that file so you have to wait for it so when it will be done then i will come back again so here our installation is successfully installed here you can see there is a package generated successfully and when it should be done then it's automatically redirected to our root directory okay so it's now perfect now we have to do we have to actually add some of the providers like add service providers there is the intervention image so that is actually already added that things in our providers area right now i only want to need add this one so i just copy it and if you go to this providers area you can see i already added that things before okay that is the image service provider so for the reasons we don't need to add this one so i only want to add our last one so that is the our one okay so here i add this and now we have to do like there is another instructions uh, i already added that phase images in our allies for the reasons i don't need to add this one and also there is a package and config and asset okay so we have to actually also run two of these so for now i just copy it and in our cmd here so here i just paste it and click on the enter now you can see it's now showing as a pub published completed and also there is another one so i just copy it and here i just paste it and click on the enter and now there is a two of this is now publishes so when two of these will be the published then in our config folder you will find one of the file as a ifm.php like if you open it so it's actually showing all the things like here what exactly the, your images for photos will be gone okay so he will save all the photos onto the photos folder all the file will be created in our file folder there is a share folder there is a top folder so here all the things okay so automatically it will be generated and now i want to do i want to install another package as a ck editor so for install that package you have to go your like i just go to the google and here you just search it with the laravel ck editor okay so like there is actually the ck editor i just open it and here that is also a lot of the resources but right now i only want to open that with this one that is a ck editor page and into this page first of all this all that an instruction you will get that things from here there is a ck editor package like there is an installation all that code okay so first of all you have to do you have to copy that command and in your root directory that means here that means project directory here i paste it and click on the enter so it will also take a little bit time so and make that sure you are connected with the internet because you will download all the resources from the internet
okay and install all the things in your project so when it should be done then i will come back again so our ck editor is now successfully installed okay so it's now successfully installed and when it should be done then it should be redirected to our home page i already discussed about that things with you and now i have to do another things like here we have to add the service provider so for doing this i have to do i have to copy that one so i just copy it and in our config that is a app and here i already added our image service provider there is a laravel a file manager service provider and right now i just paste that thing some particular disposition okay and also there are the another things like here there is an application provider so better i just uh, cut three of these okay so i just cut three of these from here and i just paste on particular that position that should be better okay so here i just paste it so now we successfully install our file manager we successfully install our laravel ck editor so when i apply that things in our real project okay so for right now i just install all the packages so we will use all the packages in our project then it should be very much interactive you know next video i will show you like like if you want to install that laravel collective then how can you install it and, and how can you use the laravel collective i will show you in our next video with the live example so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video